And oh, so let's wrap up now model four, running in parallel. So after finishing these models, you should be able to understand well how to run solvers and utilities in parallel. Okay, and do not forget that uh, that option. Uh, do not forget that option minus parallel. Use the post-processing utilities in parallel. Okay, identify the number of physical cores in your workstation or no, but okay. Do a scalability test. Visualize with para from para view the composed cases, but also the partitioner. So I'll show you two, two methods. Explore the source code and find information in the source code. Okay, in particular that information what solvers or applications utilities do not run in parallel okay so this is the end of the chapter okay the main very important takeaway use the scotch method i highly recommend you to use that one or the methods method but if you want something else it's up to you you can do your own benchmarking and never forget to use the auction minus parallel okay when running in parallel so that's all thank you very much for your attention see you in the next modules bye